these are Zenni Eyewear Bifocal Prescription Glasses. And there's something wrong with them. Something wrong with the lenses. But this video isn't about what's wrong with these glasses, it's what's right with the company. And what sets apart one online prescription glass company from another. Good customer service. And we're going to see what that means on this episode of Moondog Reviews. Hey, Moondog here. Welcome back to the channel. And for my longtime viewers, you may notice a, something a little bit different about me. I'm wearing glasses and I don't often wear glasses on video because these are driving glasses and I'm not driving. So why would I wear them? Uh, but and technically, I don't need to wear glasses while I'm driving either because I pass my eye exam at the DMV. I can read the charts fine. It's just that since my 20s, I've noticed that at night um, I tend to squint more to read the the print on uh, on highway signs so I've, I've since since my 20s i've been used to wearing glasses at night and since turning 50 i've actually had to wear bifocals because not only do i need to see things far away but you know we all have our gps's and phones so i need to be able to read uh, the gps map on my phone which is you know fairly close on the dashboard that's the reason why i wear bifocals and uh, for the last couple of years i've been buying my glasses from zinni eyewear and I've been happy with them up until this year because I bought these, these are my newest glasses, I bought them a little less than a year ago. And about seven or eight months after wearing them, I noticed something start to change about this, something weird. At night, the oncoming headlights would start smearing, uh, looking much more starbursty than they did when I first uh, bought them. And I thought maybe it was some, there was something wrong with my eyes, but no, uh, I found that if I switched out to my old eyeglasses, they looked, the, the, everything looked fine. The, the uh, headlights look fine. It's just something was up with these glasses. And well, here, let me show you what I mean. All right, I've placed this flashlight at the end of the hall here to simulate an oncoming car uh, while I'm driving at night. And this is the effect that I am getting with the Zenni Eyewear Bifocals. You can see here, this kind of smearing starburst effect. Uh, on the lenses to the point where it, these are really unusable at night. It's just so distracting and uh, uh, glaring when I'm looking at oncoming cars at night. Whereas when I put on these older glasses, you can see here, these are from another eyeglass maker. Uh, this is an older pair of glasses, about three years old with a um, um, similar though older prescription than the Zinnies, but you can see it's so much clearer uh, the image doesn't have that smear effect that these do. And by the way, I clean these glasses thoroughly uh, with just some warm water and a little bit of Dawn dishwashing detergent just to clean off any body oils that may be on here. And this is just in the lens, this, this smearing effect, uh, whereas you don't get that with these at all. So yeah, that is a fail. All right, so I was disappointed with these glasses and I was worried that I'd have to create another video um, like I did for Goggles For You where I, I bought a pair of Goggles For You um, uh, prescription sunglasses that I ordered from them and those failed terribly. Uh, the coatings just washed off the first couple of times I was just cleaning them and their customer service was atrocious and I was worried that, okay, great. Um, my Zenni eyewear glasses, um, something might have happened to their, um, to who, to their production process and that their, their, their quality was failing until they did something unexpected. They responded immediately to me via email and they assured me that they were apologized for the defective products and they would be sending me a pair of replacement glasses free of charge. No, they didn't even cost me anything on shipping and I didn't even ask for this. They just, they just straight up and offered it to me. So let's take a look at what they sent. All right, so this is the package I got from Zenni Eyewear today. These are the replacement glasses. And they're including, what is this? This is a little tool to help you measure the distance to your pupils, uh, your PD number. So that's kind of cool. I guess for my next order, I can look into a mirror and figure that out. But uh, that's included in my own uh, prescription that I got from the uh, ophthalmologist anyway, so, and a little promo piece, but let's take a look at these glasses. All right. 
same case that my previous glasses came in. And let's take a look at them. All right, these are the exact same model. And that's what they told me that they were sending me. Same model, same prescription. And they look, well, they look good. They look um, the same as my, my old pair. Uh, well, but we'll take them out tonight and see how well they work. All right, moment of truth here. These are my old pair of glasses, uh, nine month old glasses. And as you can see, they have the smear effect that I was talking about. And these are the replacement set that Zenny just sent me. And yeah, these are clear. I mean, look at the difference here between these old ones and these new ones. These are great. So good job, Zenny. All right, so as you saw, these new bifocal lenses are great. They're amazing. And they look so much clearer than the la my old pair and my old nine month old pair. Um, so yeah, great, awesome. Um, and you may be curious as to what happened with that old pair. Uh, certainly I was. Uh, well, based on the photos and videos that I shared with Zenny, they said that uh, the distortion on the lenses looked to them like an effect called crazing. And what is crazing? Sounds like something the teens are doing with an app now, but uh, no, apparently crazing is a, um, um, a defect or distortion of the coatings on a lens due to, uh, oftentimes due to excessive heat uh, exposure, which is a little odd because I've owned eyeglasses and sunglasses for many years and I've often left them in the car because you know they're my driving glasses. I've never had a problem with the lenses um, being in the car. Uh, the other thing is I live in San Francisco, which I don't know if you know anything about the climate here. Hot here is 75 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, and uh, yeah, I drive down to Southern California once in a while, but um, and I leave my eyeglasses in the car. But again, it's not like I live uh, full time in Southern California or Arizona or Las Vegas or somewhere where uh, it gets crazy hot inside of a closed car. Uh, the these or the last pair of glasses I had, yeah, I left in the car, but it, it really didn't never got that hot. So I still don't know what the what caused the crazing uh, on the older pair of eyeglasses, but I may, I may never know. But um, in the end, I have to say I am very pleased with uh, Zenny Eyewear uh, because of the level of customer service that they rendered to me. And I am not sponsored by them. I wish I was. Um, I am, I'm not even an affiliate, so I don't, it's not like I get a commission if you purchase anything from Zenny Eyewear. I'm just doing this because they did me a solid. I'm giving them a solid. I'm saying that, you know, they have great customer service. I recommend them to all of my viewers and my friends. So there you go. And if uh, you got something out of this video, please remember to hit that like button, the subscribe button, and the notification bell so you can get notified when I post my next video. So here's looking at you. Thanks for watching. Moondog out. Hey, I'd like to know what you thought of this video. Leave me a comment or chat with me on Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, MeWe, Instagram, or Locals. And if you want to see all of my videos, go to MoondogIndustries.com.